The following slideshow will take you through the analysis of the geologic cross-section. When looking at a geologic sample, we know that the layers at the bottom are always the oldest. The layers from oldest to most recent are as follows, E, G, and lastly B. It is also necessary to determine the chronology of the fault line, L, and the volcanic intrusion, A. The volcanic intrusion passes through the fault line and shows no evidence of being fractured by the fault. Because the volcanic intrusion affects the fault line, we know the fault came first. This means that the fault line occurred before the intrusion, so L is older than A. Both the fault and the volcanic intrusion pass through layers E and G. We therefore know that layers E and G were in place before the fault and volcanic intrusion, giving us E, G, L, and A. Layer B is not interrupted by either the fault or the intrusion. Therefore, B must have been laid down after the fault and the intrusion. The final chronology from the oldest to the most recent is E, G, L, A, B.